What's going on guys? We're back in Watch Dogs 2, continuing on where we left off last time. I'm glad so many of you guys enjoyed the last episode. I know YouTube's been broken for a little while now, so not that many people saw it, but I really, really enjoyed uh, making that video. I actually think it's one of the best ones uh, I've done yet, so I was, I was super excited about it. Anyways, we've got some more missions to continue on with. Uh, we've got this one right here for 87,000 followers. So where is this on the map? Uh, it's just down the road. So let's head over there then. Another thing that happened between parts is that you guys were telling me a lot to go and download the Cars On Demand app, which will basically allow me at any time to just pause the game, go and choose any car that I, I think I've driven before, and I can just have it teleported to me for free, which is really, really cool. So... I'll be doing quite a bit of that, uh, probably going forward. Anyway, so if you do enjoy these videos and you do in fact want to see some more, smash that like button, it just lets me know, uh, that you guys enjoy these and you do in fact want to see some more gameplay of Watch Dogs 2. So, we've got to go over and see R2-D2 over here and see what's going on with him. What are you doing, buddy? Are we going to go into that howl place and do some hacking? Probably. Yo, buddy, what is this car? It's like a, it's like a, it's like our own Scooby-Doo van. Nice paint job on the little guy. <laughs> our yeah. little R2-D2 guy. That was it? That was the whole cutscene? Do we really need a cutscene for that? All right, so we are WKZ San Francisco news station. Now, as always, I cannot hear what the guys are saying inside the car, so I mean... I'm just gonna drive along and pretend I know what they're saying. This Xbox glitch is so annoying. How I can never hear what people are saying. It is so incredibly frustrating just driving from place to place. And I know there's a conversation going on, but I don't know what they're saying. Like, it looks like we're heading into the mountains almost. It seems like we're not going into the city for today. This will be one hell of a drift road. Just saying, that's some nice twisties all the way down the side. Oh my god, seriously. I don't know who designed this part of the map, but good on you. Holy shit, you've built a good drift road. Fujimi Kaido 2.0, look at that! Oh my god. Alright, so, we are 120 meters away. This is the tower place. It's like a bunch of, I guess, satellites. I guess this is the news station. I guess I just run up here and we'll start. Oh, so I've got to go in there. Reboot the Sutro system. All right, well, let's try and do that. So I guess let's jump on the camera to start and do a little bit of scouting to see what is going on. So I need to head all the way over there. So what is over there? I have to go to this thing. I think it's actually inside the building, but I think we could probably just take some guys out nice and quiet. Oh, we've got a little thing over there. Now, everyone was saying I could turn these off, but I can't. It's like locked. So that's really frustrating. I could always just come in here and start taking everyone out real quiet because, I mean, they only have one motion detector. So, I think that's a good strategy. Let's let's try that. Let's try taking everyone out. Ooh, I can shock some people over there. Okay, let's turn that on and let's call people to it. Actually, let's turn the force field off. Wait for some people to get close to it first. I'm just going to go hide around the corner a bit. Oh, he's not actually going in. Well, there's that guy just standing right there. So, if I take this guy out all the way over there... Oh, is that guy going to get shocked? Is he going to get done in? He might. But can I get this guy through the fence? I might be able to. Yep, I indeed can. It's all right, that's going to cause some commotion, I'd imagine. Oh, the other guy got taken out as well. All right, so let's just walk in. We're going to take all their guys out. Let's get this guy real quick. He's just standing there, chilling, minding his own business. Sorry, bro. Just happened to be in the wrong place at the wrong time. So we're doing a good job at this so far, I think. We're doing pretty good. Ooh, 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 hide behind here. Let's just hide more this way and wait for him. You're going to stop walking and we're going to go like that. Holy shit, he had a big gun. How did he know I was here? I don't know how he knew I was here, but I want his gun. All right, well, let's take his money. He had 200 and something dollars. Did someone see me? Did I, did I pick up his gun? Can I? I don't think I can pick up his gun. Well, that's annoying. What's this right here? I've, I got like a little lunchbox. Oh shit, that was five grand. That was five grand. There was like a jewelry thing in there. All right, so I'm totally in the wrong place. I have to be lower. I have to be in the place, but underneath where I am. So that's not gone. Or do I need to be up there? No, I don't need to be up there. I need to be inside the building. I mean, I could take out the civilians, but I don't really want to. It's not very like stealthy, is it? I mean, I could take these guys out. Oh, I don't want to die. Please put the gun away. Oh my. Oh, oh, 
All right, so I can just intimidate them. I didn't know I could do that. Oh no, where am I being spotted from? All right, come on, people. We got an intruder. Push those people back. Where am I being spotted from? Where am I being shot from? What the hell? Where am I being shot from? What the hell just happened? Oh shit, there's an alarm right there. Um, well, I wish I could turn it off, but nope, I cannot. Let's drop the little buggy. Head in here. And maybe see what we can do. And there's some guy calling security. Reinforcements are being called. Well, I'm escaping right now. I mean, I could just run through. Let's just run through. Like, what are they gonna do? Oh, shit. Apparently, they're gonna shoot through the window. Because no shit's given, apparently. I tried to get up and bip one of them, but I got done in hard. We have to get in here, though, which is really annoying. And I can't turn off, like, security cameras. They're searching the area now because I shot in at that person. So they're looking around for me. So what if I now get out my little buggy, and while they're looking for me, I head in here, and I go with the thing. Oh, shit. Okay, turn that on. Zap. Get zapped. Get zapped. Get, somewhere. get zapped. Hello. Get zapped. Uh. Get zapped. You're in the zappy yeah. zone. Okay, I'm just gonna blow it up. That's your fault. That's not my problem. Oh, my car's on fire. My little RC car's on fire. All right, we've probably attracted some people though. But if I head here, press Y to unlock. Yep. I need this. 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 And then I get control of every single, like, door and stuff. So I can actually get to where I need to go. But I'm safe for right now. No one... No one is outside. No one knows I'm there right now. So that's okay. That's okay. They don't need to know where I am. You just ignore the little RC car driving past you. That's okay. Alright, so we've driven all the way in here. Can I open up a door? Is there a door? Oh. Okay. Well, I'm in. Little RC car is doing it brilliant. I, I didn't even have to walk in the place. Okay. So have we done that? Reach the top. I have to get to the top place of where I just was. Let's uh, call this back to us. And then we need to run up to the roof. Reach the top of the tower. What's the, What do they mean by the top? Like... Like, do they mean the legitimate top of the thing? So, I don't think there's any, like, security in, around here. Actually, no, there totally was. There totally was the security up here. So, I'm gonna need to watch out. And there are stairs right there. Hear that? Got him. So, do I have to get up to the top of this thing? It says 43 meters, like, that way. So, what does that mean? Do I have to go over there? I do have to go over there. How do I get over there? Is that door unlocked? Can I just walk in? Oh, I think this is probably where I got shot from the first time. There's a guard down there. That worked out! Reinforcements have been called. Um, I'm just gonna melee you. Just take you down. Yep, good. Okay, I'm gonna need an actual gun for this. You're kinda far. Okay, down. Go, 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 run. Run, bro. Can I just walk in? Why? Why? I did it! No! I did it! I did what I was supposed to! Just saying. That's all I needed to do. Okay. So there's like very few security guards left. Let's just reload. Holy shit, he's got a shotgun. Keep getting him in the feet. There we go. Taking him out. There's one more all the way over there. Okay, you're just gonna run away. Okay, I'm just gonna open the door then. Okay, I've I've done it. I've done it. Nailed it. Even though that last security guard is still there, this is gonna work. Now, the issue that I see with this is getting out of here because they're probably all gonna have woken up by the time I get down. I'm escaping, 
So that's pretty good. Alright, so I have to walk up to this. Press left bumper. Oh, really? It's one of these. Of course it is. How do I get these side ones? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That's really cool. Okay. That got that. Open that. Spin that. Got that. This one round. And up there. Nailed it all the way to the top. Can I get all the way to the top? Can I... Can I camera all the way up there? Oh, I've got to use that camera. See? All right. Nailed it all the way up. Internal network unlocked. Holy shit. Look at that view. Am I moving like a satellite? Align the transmitter. So I got to turn this way. That's all I had to do? I just had to turn that way? How the hell am I going to get out of here? Like, I need to parachute out. I think. Hey. Oh, shit, man. Nice view. Yeah, no. That is a nice view. Announce the launch of home. Oh no. Oh, no. Hell yeah. Yes. Just simply yes. push him a button. <laughs> okay. That's what? the dead sec logo. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Would you oh care to comment God. on that? Oh my god. Oh, he nice. did throw up a drone. That's cool. <laughs> We're done. We're done here. We're done. Nailed it. You took a bad beat, buddy. It happens. Listen to me, you smart son of a bitch. You promise. I not your smartest move, What Steven. is he? A karate you master? You've monumental ah. fuck-ups recently. You're gonna be okay? Say yes. <laughs> There you go. I'm gonna get you a glass of water. He is a karate master. He just bah! and the guy died. Like, look at him. He, he's choking on dick. Oh, well, look, my stick's falling off. See, me and the elite controllers is a love-hate relationship. The sticks fall off a hell of a lot. I mean, fall off. I do play with them. Oh, achievement. No place like home. Finish Operation Home Sweet Home. We gained 87,000 followers for that. That's sweet. So was it a satellite all the way up there? I think so. I can't be certain. Though. I can't see all the way up there. So I just want to put a little pause in today's Let's Play and go find something kind of cool. Oh! <laughs> I was wondering if that would work. It works. Oh, shit. It's like a, it's like a BMW 5 Series. Sort of, kind of. I mean, those lights are very BMW. All right, well, let's get the nitrous on. Get all the way over to this place that is 3,000 meters away. This is pretty far where we're going, but I promise it's going to be worth it. So one of my good friends and Canadian fellow YouTubers, uh, who you may know, Maca91, he makes some awesome, awesome, like, achievement guides uh, on his YouTube channel, and he does a really bunch of cool stuff, if I'm honest. Anyways, he made a video a little while ago covering some unique vehicles in Watch Dogs 2. So today I wanted to put a little pause in the Let's Play here and go find one of them and try them out. The one that I'm going for right now is like a Mazda RX-7 that's completely modified and stuff like that and can apparently drift like an absolute legend. So I wanted to, I wanted to drive over here today. We're going to be going over the Golden Gate Bridge, I think. That is Golden Gate Bridge, yep. And we're gonna go find this really, really cool car, and then we can get back on with the missions and stuff and find out what we're going to do next. Because we finished the first three missions so far already, and I mean, things have been going well for us. I, I, I feel like I'm improving in this game and stuff and getting a little bit better at the old hacking stuff and figuring out how, how I should be doing missions and stuff. And I, I feel like it's just going well. I hope I'm in the right place. Oh, is it gonna be here? My very special car. Yes, it is. There it is! This is like, it's sort of like a Mazda RX-7 slash Supra, sort of kind of, I think it's more RX-7, but it looks so sick. It's called Ice Cube, and it just apparently drives like a legend. So I guess uh, we're going to drive this over to our next mission, so let's open our DeadSec app up and find our main operation looking glass. So yeah, I believe you can find a normal version of this car around if you look for it enough, but this one apparently comes with a big wing and some beefed up performance. It also says rotor on the back, so yeah, okay, this is totally an RX-7 then. Uh, we got like a rotary plate. We've also got like a Quebec license plate, like I'm from Montreal, right? It says California, but that looks like a Quebec plate, if I'm honest. All right, so let's try to do some drifts around these twisties here. See how it goes. Oh, sorry, bro. 
Holy shit, it really wants to be sideways, though. This is so sick. Mazda RX-7 in Watch Dogs 2. Something I didn't think I'd be doing when I first started up this game, if I'm honest. Anyways, I totally forgot to mention. Uh, there's seven of these very unique vehicles, apparently. So I'll link to uh, Maka's video in the description down below if you'd like to check it out for yourself. Go subscribe to him. He makes some awesome stuff. So, yeah. Now, I'm wondering, if this is on my DedSec app, can I call this car... Or not my DedSec app. My Cars on Demand app. Can I call this car in, like, whenever? Like, this is a sports car. Would this be on my list? Oh, it totally is on my list. Oh, that's awesome. Great. Good to know. So, all right, let's take a little bit of a roundabout route. Try drifting this thing through San Francisco. That was totally a Tesla back there. Holy shit. Let's try drifting this thing a little bit. See how it does. In Mac's video, when he was driving this thing around, he was saying that uh, the thing feels a little bit driftier than normal cars. I mean, mine's a little bit smashed up, so it's probably not going to be the best test of it. But it does feel really, really smooth when drifting. It feels good. It's like just coming through the intersection, you can actually smash the handbrake and then actually drift pretty decently, if I'm honest. Like coming up the hill here. Oh, I think my hood just blew off. Yeah, it did. And I mean, the thing is hella fast, too. It's like it's got some modifications on it. I'm not sure exactly what, but it definitely feels a little bit faster than the majority of the cars that I've been driving recently. Anyway, so let's leave it out there. Maybe it'll get fixed. If it doesn't, I'll call in a new one. And let's go start up our next mission. All right, hello! You are my next mission person. What are we doing? Where are we going? Shit, 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 shit. Hey, man, shit, what's, shit. What, hey, what's going on? A chunk of our followers and bots came from inactive or dead invite accounts. Hey, wait, so someone used a social media site to boost our numbers? Who? And how many fucking accounts, I man? don't know who, but it came from inside invite. Someone with admin access, I'm sure of that. Ch we need to find out. Marcus. So we have to go and investigate invite false accounts. Hey, it's daytime now. Sweet. So my RX-7 is... Oh, yes, it's fixed. Oh, looking sick. All right. So we're... Really? We're heading around the corner? Well, I guess this will be a short test drive of the RX-7. Oh, it drifts a lot. And it, like, it keeps wanting to drift, too. It's like you go around the corner... You get the nitrous on, and look at that! Holy shit! You can actually drift in this game! Like, I thought you could before, but no. In this car, you really, really can. Oh, invite, it's right here. Where did I... Where did I park? Did I park right here? Oh, I did. No, I parked over there. I don't know. Anyways, we gotta go into the building. Now, this will probably be a restricted area, as per always. Access the elevator to the CEO's office. Okay. So now, are there gonna be any areas where I can just walk in? Can I walk in here? No, every door is locked. Okay, so how am I gonna... Oh. Okay, well, let's get the camera in here. Oh, shit, the person's all the way over there. Okay, camera over here. Hack that. Okay, so I got the key. I've now- I can now get in the building. And the elevator is only 27 meters away, but if I open this door, am I gonna find that this is a restricted area? I mean, I look like everyone who works here, though. So I doubt it. Like, if I just walk in like a normal-looking person, I feel like that's okay. Okay, so I need that. Oh shit. So, we gotta get up there. Okay. Alright, so let's just open the door. Am I gonna find that this is a restricted area? I'll close the door behind me, so no one can really do anything. I'll unlock this. I don't know if this is supposed to be how I'm supposed to get in, but I feel like this is a pretty good way. I just don't want anyone to see me in here. Alright, so let's get back downstairs, get in the elevator, alright, press Y, and now we're heading up. Look at that! I don't think we've ever had a more successful start to a mission, but... That was good. So what are we gonna do here? He's got a laptop. Okay, now we're gonna get busted. If someone comes in now, we're screwed. Marcus, oh, is this a bad time? shit. Sort of feels like a bad time. It's the Karate Master. Night at the beach. Man, I knew you looked fucking familiar. What's Bloom's CTO doing in the office of the CEO of Invite? You used us to sell CTO S 2.0 to them. What is the ultimate deterrent against hackers like you? Here it is, Marcus. Your record is back on file, your backdoor access is plugged, and those bots I gave you, are gone. 
Oh, 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 and there's a warrant out for your arrest. Oh, shit. Oh, he's screwed now. Well, on that bombshell, I am gonna end it there. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, subscribe down below for more videos like this in your subscription box. I'm sure I will get a another unique car fairly soon. So if that's something you want to see, subscribe, smash that like button, and I'll see you guys in the next one. See you guys then. Bye!